Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Good Prime, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video. Sorry, that was a little bit more excitable than what I'm usually used to, but I do have some good news for you tonight. I know that a lot of you saw um, the, the um, fan mail that I got that had my lovely YouTube cup with Heath Haskins on there and everything else. I've been using this cup for ever since I got it, and it is durable. It is awesome. It is fully washable. Um, it is 16 ounces. I've measured because my coffee is very important to me. It's not as much as the 32 can ounce thing, but that's okay because I have information on how to actually order one for yourself. Um, dang it. How do I do this? Okay. Copy that. I'm, I'm just going to throw some text up here on the screen and you can absolutely, uh, okay. Okay. It's by way down South, um, by Amanda way. And a 20 ounce cup is for $25, a 30 ounce cup is for $35, and she also does t-shirts too and other things. So give them a call, see, see what you're thinking, see what they're thinking, um, hold on. By the way, this is totally not sponsored. They didn't ask me to do this. I actually asked them for the information. I'm doing it for them because they're amazing. Um, I, I really like the cup. And she did the ornaments as well. You saw the little ornaments inside the, the box opening thing? <laughs> What am I missing? What am I missing? Okay, text, text, there we go. I need to add a text into the thing. This is gonna be um, way down south. And I'm gonna add that in. We're just gonna paste in this little text right there. Beautiful, beautiful. <clears throat> okay, come on, please. Okay, we need a little bit bigger than that code, seriously. And I'm gonna make it bold, why not? Boom, like that. Okay, anyhow. Oh, come on, come on. There it is. There it is. There we go. Okay, so I'm just going to leave this up for a second because I did a boo-boo. Code did an oopsie. I even did it in my, like, in my thumbnail. It was down there, and it was showing, and I didn't pay attention to it. <clears throat> Mr. Present. <laughs> Oh, you did what? I know, Code, the king of lumber, the master of the chop saw, the um, antagonist of the interim. I don't know. I missed a present on the back wall. Like, it's in the thumbnail yesterday. And I missed it. Why in the world did I miss it? Okay, check this out. This is called the gift of good health. It's supposed to be the opposite of... Um, of what's his face's um, bad health or uh, bad choice decisions or whatever it's called. <coughs> Coach, you just made my day. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, sorry. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna keep the the information up there forever. So make sure you pause the video, go back if you need to, whatever it is. Just hit, hit, like, do the, the thing and, and make sure you, like, go get the info and then if you want. Uh, Christmas is right around the corner. They make great stocking stuffers, great gifts. Uh, I know that it's colder weather and if you're, if you need something. Uh, they should sh ship to anywhere inside the U.S. Uh, and overseas if they can get the P.O. boxes or the addresses correct. Um, not that they wouldn't. No, no, that that was horrible. I should not have said it like that. That was a bad way, bad advertising code. Bad, bad, bad. <clears throat> but I mean, it's not really advertising. Advertising would have consisted of them like paying me uh, for like sponsorship ads, base and stuff like that. And I don't do that. Um, I mean, I've never had any kind of big corporations come at me like that. So if you happen to own Microsoft or Google or something like that, and you want to come hang out sometime, you know, just hit me up. Send me a message. We'll talk about ad space for you. <laughs> Microsoft comes to me. Dude, you're the best option for us to, to advertise our new Surface Pro. <laughs> Wait, what? <clears throat> that would be pretty cool though, right? Have exclusive rights to the advertising of uh, Microsoft's Surface Pro. <sighs> Dude, you were so creepy through the window. <laughs> Oh, what's your name? Craftlaw. What's up, Craftlaw? I think I saw you the other day. Better you joined me. In my <laughs> Hi. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, it's not going to be a long video tonight. It's it's literally it's to make up for my silliness. 
wanted to say stupidity, but it wasn't a stupid move. It was just... It was pretty stupid. It was just dumb. I, I missed it. Okay. Way down south. I'm going to take you off there real quick. There you go. Like I said, if you need some of that information, go back in the video. You can, you can grab it again. And uh, amazing, amazing cups. Amazing artwork. I mean, the quality is just awesome. So. Sorry. Going off about these cups. Jeez. Code, we're here for some lumber. We're not here for some cups. That's okay. You're here. For, you're here for the cups too. Uh oh. No, I'm stuck. I am stuck. <laughs> oh, I'm stuck. <clears throat> okay, fine. Reset. Blech. There we go. All right, and I'll just I'll walk back down here, you know, because I don't want to rush off. Well, I guess I I could. He got glitched. Why? No, code. Why? Why? Uh-oh. That's not good. My E button is broken. It's broke. I think there's some like major lag going on. I didn't want to say anything, but it could be possible. Hi, buddy. Do you want to uh, give me a ride? Thanks, Craft. Appreciate it. I hate it when that happens. I know, bad. Isn't it? Boop. Thank you, buddy. Now, I'm not going to be able to... Um... Okay, hold on. Yep. And I'm stuck again. But I was able to save the thing. So now I'm like, no, I can't move! Help me, help me, help me! This is what happens whenever the glitch happens. And I think, okay, <clears throat> Defaultio, if you're listening, I think I know what this is, okay? When your uh, script, because I know in my script that I created, whenever my context script was running, um, it would look for um, the click button and the move buttons, right? There's something going on with when the dialogue and the move context, like the, the pickup context, when you when you don't have anything in your hands and you click on a piece of wood, you can pick it up. Um, it's like a can carry or this object can be carried. There's a context binding the key controls somewhere in there. That's what this is. So if you know how to fix this bug, Defaultio, it should be in the context grab script of the avatar itself. This isn't... This is not server side. This is something client side, but I, I don't know your modules. I don't know your script, but I definitely know where to start looking. So, <laughs> same thing was happening with me. And what I found um, it was it wasn't locking up my character. I found that if I had an ax in my hand that was scripted fine, it was perfect. It wouldn't work properly because the context script, my player script, was taking over the key binds. So something is happening with the key bond binds on the local character script to stop uh, stop it from moving. Uh oh, there we go. So in order to fix this, I've got to jump out of the server. I'm so sorry, you guys. I'm going to have to hop this server. Just because it's it's so glitchy. <laughs> I can't I can't even sign because it would require me to press E. All good. Have fun playing. <laughs> Love. Sorry. I I am truly sorry. Bye. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you too. Look, I can't even shut my door. I had an accident. <laughs> All right, hold on. There we go. That's where I need to be. And play. So that should disappear in just a second. How long have we recorded? We've only recorded nine minutes of a video? Oh, that will not do. That just will not do, Mr. Anderson. Let's go load. Load, 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 load. And slot one. Yes, slot one. 
Did, did, did we advertise an email address of some kind? We did not. Oh. It is by phone only, so. Mm. I'll see if I can get, like, an, uh, an email address or maybe a Facebook page or maybe um, email or something like that. I'm loading now. It says it's working. It says it's working. It says it's working. Because when you work it, you let me work it. Chop it down and reverse it. This one to put the word to put it. This one to put the word to put it. Work it. <laughs> it's a joke. Okay, this part is seriously boring. This is why people edit, is because they don't want to wait for these things. I should probably edit, but from everything that I've been told, I don't need to edit, and that's a very rare trait, especially when you're hanging on like every single word that I'm saying. Um, beef stew. See, even like that, that was like so interesting to me. <laughs> Just kidding. Honestly, um, I've I've looked into um, going and editing my videos and changing things up and trying to reach that twenty five thousand views per video thing, and I just I don't know that I've got the time or the patience to upload edited videos because what should be a thirty minute video renders at two hours. It takes over two hours to render, to put it back into video format. And then once that's done, I have to then upload it again. So that means four hours total time. I don't have four hours at night to do that. I don't, I don't have the time to, oh, Danny, no. I don't have the time at nighttime that it takes, that it requires for me to do a video, get it edited, upload it, and get it back out. But that's also like, because I don't edit, that's also why I can get out so many videos quickly and proficiently. I mean, pretty proficient. Thumbnails, descriptions, stuff like that. Most of that stuff is like pre-rolled and pre-done for me. I've got, I've got everything pretty much set. Intros, outros, I've thought about changing them multiple times, but you know what? I'm very proud of my intro. I did it myself. You know, I, I followed along with one of the Blender script tutorial thingies. Um, I did my own sounds. I did my own animation of it like flying in. That's mine. That, that, I did that myself. Nobody made that for me. So, I'm very proud of it. A lot of people have been like, oh, it's so annoying. I know, but that's also why I did it. Chaboom, hello. Code, you open the new gifts? You can't open the new gifts. You can check them can't open them yet. There we go. Okay. Danny, you know this. It happens every single year, dude. You gotta buy buy the presents, and then the presents don't open until after Christmas. Christmas, uh, on Christmas Day. About 4 o'clock uh, Eastern Standard Time, Christmas Day. Uh, until Christmas. <clears throat> so since we're kind of stuck here anyway, why don't we just do some more cleanup? Okay, yeah. Oh, by the way, I think the context uh, of the boxes is, is, is fixed. Yeah, old oxidation gift. Smells like iron. Should be a rusty axe. Um, gift of good health. It makes you hungry. From what I'm told, it's some kind of bowl. Uh, the gift of unhealthy diet. Somebody said this was a soda can, but when I look at it, all right, I'm just I'm just going off what I'm seeing. Okay, I smash this into a door. Watch, Coach Smash. I see cheeseburgers, 
in there. See that? Those have got to be cheeseburgers through the wrapping. I don't think it's a soda. I think it's a jar of cheeseburgers. That's that's my guess. Uh, this is going to be a wobbly head. That is going to be a ball. And this, I have no clue at all. It smells crispy. The burnt gift. Somebody said it was um, something else. Anyhow. There's last year's presents. Purple wobbly head. You know, that, that would look great on the back of a truck. Right there. Come on. There. Get it. Get it. <laughs> That's awesome. All right. Let's get to sorting. Where did I leave off at? I got that one all done, didn't I? Okay. So next up, we need to collect all fire presents again. I'm just gonna. Oh, oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Just gonna grab these uh, fire presents right here. Kobe. Kobe. I don't know why they say that. I don't like cheese. <laughs> I know it's basketball. Jeez, you don't have to comment. <laughs> Everybody's like, Code, you're so stupid. Kobe doesn't mean Kobe Jack cheese. <laughs> it's a basketball player. I know. It's making a joke. Jeez, it's dad jokes. Christmas is a great time for dad jokes. You know that? You, you know that? Oh, there's a. Oh, no, no. This one. Dad's a fire present. Do, 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 do. That's a fire present. Oh, that's a fire present. Boop. <laughs> but I was like, code is so messy. I know. Should I go ahead and build up one for those presents? The, the stripey presents? I probably should. Drop. Drop. Close them down. Open up. Shop. Whoa. No. That's a cool primate rolls. <laughs> oh goodness. I, th I think all the dads got that joke. That was that was a good one. Maybe some moms. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do 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 wait, wait, wait what? Mm. Can't open until Christmas. Code whitelist me. I help. Danny, you know I don't whitelist anybody. I know I've whitelisted you in the past, but... Mm, times are a-changing. There we go. Good, 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 good. I know you want to help. Okay? I understand. But I had some trust for some other people, and when I whitelisted them, they ended up deleting my base. So... Please forgive me for not doing so. He's busy, so busy sorting some presents. This is like four layers of presents, dude. I'm thinking about just putting a, a lid on this thing once it's full. Marking it fire gifts and then like, that's that. No more fire gifts. Any fire gifts I find, just toss them off the base. I think I'm good for a little while. I think I could probably retire without ever getting another fire gift again. Just saying. Forward and jump out. Freak people out. Did I make a floor? I can't remember. I don't know if I left a floor or not. Um, I should probably get this stuff out of here, shouldn't I? Yeah. Um, hold up. Can I push all of this this direction? Push, push, push. 
push, 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 push. What about with the big box? Will the big box let me push? It's got a little bit more mass than everything else. That is not working. Okay. So we're just uh, just going to go one by one. Here we go. Having fun with everyone. Here we go. On the way. My base is just basically going to be a huge storage compartment. Which kind of makes me sad. I wish I could get back into like building saw tutorials and creating things like that. Man, this is kind of making me dizzy. Ooh. All right, let's go to this one, and we're going to go to large floors. Let's do a turn and a rotate right there. Right there, do rotate, and we're going here, and here. Very good, very well. Very well. A boom. It's not gonna be enough, is it? Oh dang it. Okay. Do we have a little piece of wood? Hey, here's a little piece of wood. Uh, I don't know that that's a full hold on. I'll chop it in half just in case. Ooh, Amber Axe is having a bit of a time with it. There we go. Boink. Come on, take it. There we go. And in you go. I don't know that I'm gonna have that many of the uh, these kind of presents, but oh well. Okay, that's going to annoy me somewhat. And eventually, I'm not going to care which direction they are facing. But for now, on the first ones, we might as well make them right. There we go. Just like that. What was in these things, anyway? Um, I have completely forgotten. Ooh. Oh, it was a candy cane. I forgot. Can't believe I forgot. I like your base. Thank you. Here, you know what? I'll leave it. I'll leave it in here, so we remember what it is. Hopefully, I don't fill this one. Pop all the way. He's like, he opened it. <laughs> you bet I did. Needed to see what it was. Oh gosh, we're at 23 minutes. I meant to only go for like 15. Jeez. Okay, so the new present is out. It's the present of good health. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end. Love you guys. Subscribe. Do that if you want. And we'll talk to you very soon. Outro.